Hello, we're here again with Dr. Bruno Chickley, the developer of Lymph Drainage Therapy, to talk about the class that we refer to as LAFR, Lymphatic Articulation Fluid Release. Dr. Chickley, would you like to uh, tell us about that? Yes, this is a very, very interesting class. We taught it for about 10, 12 years. It's a material from LDT3, third level of LDT, and advanced one LDT. And people really want to learn how to move uh, restriction between the bones and inside the bones um, without any um, uh, danger, something very gentle, non-invasive. And so we put all that material, to get the material in one class and you learn every single articulation basically in the body and articulation you never heard of probably because they are there in embryo infused. But sometimes those are the weak spots in the, the problem in the joint. So, um, for example, your elbow sometimes is not getting out, the problem is not in the real joint in the elbow or the, the real head. Sometimes it's between the real head and the shaft. And sometimes it's sometimes a place of weakness that was fused in embryo, that's the one that, where the problem is. So we have to release those little joints and it's done with so much gentleness, with a, spe a specific inherent movement with the bone, a specific motility inside the bone, and there's two, three different things we bring together um, to be able to release a, a bone um, so it's gentle and stays in place a, a long time. And that's, that's what I use most of the time in my practice. 95% of any joint articulation problem I have, I use that technique. It works very well, stays very long in place. I will check the next visit, it's still in place usually. Um, so we're going to go over every articulation of the cranium, so the sutures, and the suture, for example, that fuse in embryo, like the metopic suture that fuse um, between the two frontal bones, and everything midline, by the way, fused. You have two nasal bones, you have here, between the two jaw, a symphysis menti, symphysis of the, of, the, of the jaw, then you have the sternum that fuse, in the embryo you have two sternal plates that come back together, and all the way in the back, you have vertebrae fuse midline also. So you have a lot of place where it's not the facets that may go out, it may be these specific embryological articulations. So in four days, we're going to go over every chance and every embryological articulation we can reach and uh, work with interosseous restriction, a little bit with intraosseous restrictions, with a technique that um, we teach usually in level three, as I said, but it's, it's fairly easy to learn and you'll keep it forever and you won't bring any problem anymore with uh, trying to use uh, techniques that are going to fight sometimes the, the joints against the barrier, trying to break a barrier. It's all done with ease and with a fluid um, rhythm, uh, synovial technique um, inside the joint that will help us bring back the bone together just with the body um, a rhythm. The body is going to bring it back by itself. We're going to help the body in its way to um, bring um, those joints in perfect alignment. It's very fast, it stays in place. So, a lot of people ask us to be able to do that. So, we have this whole class for it, and uh, people really like it. And we do things that sometimes are not taught in even um, college and places. For example, we're going to release the ethmoid and the vomer or things that people don't usually work. We have a whole um, afternoon with uh, all the joints inside the mouth, uh, the skull, the ribs, um, the pelvic, uh, the, um, the extremities. So all those are viewed with a lot of detail and you can have a lot of efficiency uh, in your everyday practice. And you can apply that also because it's so gentle. You can apply it to babies you can apply it for somebody with acute trauma. You're not going to try to fight something in the tissue. Um, people with osteoporosis, elder people, animal. You don't like to crack or to go with heavier technique with animals. That is very gentle. And so that's one of the, the reasons why uh, people really want to take those classes. And uh, I'm going to show it because I think we're going to have much less side effect with this kind of techniques. And because we're working with the synovial fluid, is the other lymphatic curriculum a prerequisite to this class? No, there's absolutely no prerequisite because it's a different rhythm. So you don't have to take lymph one or any other class before. You just have to review your anatomy of your joints and uh, you'll be fine. 
Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dr. Tickley.